So it's common knowledge. Most people are nervous when they go to the dentist. But what causes that fear? Because it's supposed to be, um, you know, it's the fear of the unknown. Um, from what they see in the movies, what they hear from friends, and it builds up over the years into real fear. It doesn't have to be like that. With modern technology, things that used to be very complicated are now dealt with very quickly, and uh, we can get to the root of any issue. So you specialize in nervous patients. Can you tell me how, ex how does that exactly work? Our nervous patient program is based on gaining as much information from the patient um, when they come to the practice for the first time and trying to get to the, uh, the, every issue that they might have built up over the years in their mind regarding dentistry. Um, by finding those issues and um, going over it with the patient and introducing different techniques, different ways of uh, exposing that, will give the patient more time in the practice and try and overcome uh, any issue they might have. Okay, when you're talking just this personal bubble, what is, what is that all about? Personal bubble, we, uh, every individual has a, a parameter. I suppose you could give it a, a measurement of some sort. And uh, this is uh, how close you can get to, to one. The profession of dentistry is obviously uh, um, bursting that bubble on a routine basis. You, get, you have to get close to patients to be able to examine, to be able to do whatever it is that, uh, that, that we do. I had a chance to tour your, your facilities with you. Um, and you not only fix problems, you also prevent them from happening in the future or happening again. In our practice, we're trying to get to the root of the problem. It's not good enough for any dentist, especially in our practice, for a patient to come in and have the treatment and go home and not know what caused the treatment in the first place and how to prevent it from happening again. Um, we try and find out as much uh, uh, as we can from patients' dietary habits um, and oral hygiene habits and trying to find out what, uh, what way we can stop the problem from recurring again. You like to keep it simple and to the point. Tell me your philosophy. My philosophy about dentistry for the past two decades has been based on one fact, which is um, if any treatment on any tooth is not good enough for my mouth or my, uh, my son's mouth, and my year and a half uh, old son, it's not good enough for my patient's mouth. There are limitations in everything, in every practice, and uh, what, what we've always tried to do in, in, in practice is to, to give the best that we could give to, if it was, as if it was our own tooth. Uh, and uh, give the same to our uh, individual patients. Dr. Me, why should people choose the New King's Road Dental Practice? New King's Road Dental Practice has um, been going on for the past 12 years. We started from scratch with no patients. Uh, over the past 12 years we've got 9,000 patients and uh, the best form of advertising we've had has been the word of mouth. Uh, is what people experience in our practice that encourages them to encourage others to come back. Um, and that's uh, the, our nervous patient program has been very successful. Um, the choice of uh, this team that we've had in the past and currently has, has been uh, the background of uh, our success.